Well, new tonight, new changes are coming to West Virginia International Jaeger Airport as Spirit Airlines decides to cease operation from Charleston this year. Yeah, Eyewitness News reporter Hannah Klein joins us live inside Jaeger Airport. And Hannah, what are travelers saying tonight? Well, Dave, Gina, we've been at the airport all day, and travelers tell us it's already hard to get an affordable flight, especially one that's close enough to home. That was something I was never expecting to get a phone call about. And now I can't even get there as soon as possible. Unfortunate news for Brian Carrillo as he stranded at West Virginia International Jaeger Airport trying to get home to Orlando, Florida for his best friend's funeral. I had bought this plane ticket to get to Florida as soon as possible to check in on her, see when they, if they needed help with the funeral or anything, check in on how all my friends were doing that were close to her. Brian had missed his Spirit Airlines flight by just minutes after waiting for a rideshare service that was delayed. I tried finding other flights. There's no other flights that were my, within my price range. There's not much I could do. And now I just have to sit and wait until driving surfaces work and I can find a flight. Spirit Airlines will no longer be at Jaeger Airport starting on May 4th. The only airline services will be United, Delta and American Airlines. The airline says they will issue a notice of cancellation to all passengers who have booked their flights after that date. As for Carrillo, he says Spirit is the most affordable and easiest flight and with them leaving West Virginia in the next few months, he's left worried about how he will continue to travel home. I didn't even get to use it. I didn't get my bags checked or anything. Now there's nothing I can do with that ticket and I don't even get the money back that I spent on it. And we reached out to airport representatives for further comment. Unfortunately, they weren't able to give us any additional information. But for now, live in Yeager Airport, Hannah Klein, Eyewitness News.